You did it. Let's see what it draw. <laughs> Father, up there. <laughs> Halfway there. There's gotta be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. <laughs> Think you can uncover that geyser from here? I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. <laughs> nice one. Freezing the guys are under the wheel. Maybe. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Lad, if I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. 
Atreus. Look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidharia, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. We talk we to you don't for want any trouble, please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in. The buildings here really are incredible. The detail in the woodwork is quite extraordinary. Is that a statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Or feel. Sindri! Hello! I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. What is a dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oof, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material. Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for uh, finally trying it. What's it gonna be this time? Patience. I find it's best to see these things oh, in action. Uh. Take aim at that gate there, but before you loose, say, Skialfa. 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 Ah! Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlers in need of Valir. How was I supposed to know they were there? <laughs> <laughs> Behind! Okay, so, Derlin. At Sindri, your service. Any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. Till we meet again! So this lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an Odinism if I ever had one.
another of Cavassier's poems. Best of luck. Any outsider is considered a threat. Is that to protect the dwarves? It sounds like it. But knowing Odin, there's sure to be an ulterior motive. Well, everyone's hiding on this side too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of. To keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. This looks promising, right? Well, it's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You. Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <clears throat> None taken. Fair point, though. Very well. I think that's him. Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours, named Durlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Durlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there, and you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess? What mess? Later, brother. I wish to hear of this. Mess. The rig's in the bay. Why don't you ask the condescending skull? Head, I've got skin. But he's right. I made a mistake. I'd have us shut them down. Sorry, one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here, please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off.
Come. A boat cannot be far. Huh. Really, your Sindri made it sound like Derlin was some sort of rebellion leader. Doesn't sound like anyone's following him. Was being the key word here, little brother. I saw a dock back there. Maybe there's a boat we can use to get out. No time for drinks now, brother. Dublin's office is just a short boat ride away. A firebomb from the chief anti-Odin propagandist in Durland's Rebellion. Quite a sharp wit she had until she turned to subtle means of resistance. Find you, watch out! <laughs> Brother, I had a thought. What if you took a stealthy approach to our next battle? No. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah, uh, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you.
Mimir, were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. On your right! <laughs> If the dwarves didn't like working for Asgard, couldn't they just quit? You do what? Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfheim. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. If they stopped working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Oh, that's clever. And awful. Seed to Muspelheim. Think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago? What makes you say that? Wishful thinking, I guess. Going through Surtur's gauntlet, it was fun. It was training. You didn't have fun? Hmm. Well, anyway, we should look for the other half of the seed. Once it's whole again, we can see where it leads. <laughs> Spawning a little wretch is like there's no tomorrow. The hurry will be so. <laughs> that could help us. I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. If the 
dwarves agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They made their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfheim ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. How did these rigs come to be? I had them built to harvest ore for armaments. Essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something. Taking a break before visiting Durlin? Very wise. He can be... a lot. Whatever you need. Hey! What happened to all the armor we made you already? I used it. Well, maybe try to make this one last longer. I will not. That might be my best piece yet today. Be safe! No, it's still here. What? The island near the geyser. We need to get the key from it and unlock this door. We need... I need... to set right a very old wrong. Bloody drogger holes! We've got to clear out all these undead bastards! You're on fire, Kratos! It will burn! It's bad!
one raven down. Prisoner of sorts. <laughs> you collected Kavasir's stories? Give him here! Huge fan! That belonged to one of the rebels, didn't it? What can I make for you? By the way, if you're headed to the mining rigs in the bay, could you bring me any slag you find? I could use the material for my crafting. There's another mining rig on this island, brother. Smell that smoke. Why would the dwarves agree to work for the Ace here in the first place? That's the heart of it, eh? You lied to them. I lied to them. Ugh. <sighs> 
Okay, Mimir. To the blacksmiths of Svartalfheim, the creation of a weapon was a sacred thing. But Odin just wanted as many blades as he could get, as fast as he could get them. With every stolen resource and mediocre blade, the dwarves lost a bit of themselves. Here's Spartle Fine Slag? Give it here. I'll disinfect my tools. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos? Take care of your armor, and it'll take care of you. The dwarves arrived because of you. I am not wrong there, brother. Odin would have wiped out every last dwarf in Svartalfheim. If he couldn't use their skills, no one could. Mir, how many stories have you told about Odin and Thor, and all the bad things they've done? Let's see how many we can remember. Seems like Father could use his memory refreshed. My memory of them requires no refreshment. They invaded our home. Yeah, but I'm talking about history. All the other people they've hurt. Let's see. Okay, there was Thalmor, the stonemason. Aye, he quarreled with his son. Went into the night to find him, found Thor instead. And there was Thalmor's son, Grimther. Who built the walls of Asgard, and whispered something of importance to Freya before his betrayal and assassination. There was Groa, of course. The knowledge keeper and prophet of Ragnarok. Thor murdered her husband, and Odin covered it up before doing her in himself. Ah, but enough of that for now. Whoa, what? That guy's was huge! Yes, it should lead us to the key for that watchtower door.
Smell the smoke? There's another mining rig here. You speak of your deeds with shame. Do you regret not allowing Odin to kill them? I don't... No. Bet we could swing across that, uh, lift thing. Gantry. Gantry. Thanks. Not quite right. It's got to be the right spot. Well, experimented. We could break through the ground here, if you found a high enough place to drop from. Surprised the dwarves didn't shut these rigs off themselves. One or two tried. The Einherjar made examples of them. They killed the dwarves? Can you have convinced them not to? Aye. should help. Huh. Impressive.
Think we can reach it there. <clears throat> yeah, that looks right. could call so meager a task done. A wee drop out of the Asgardian occupational bucket. You must live with your deeds, but do not be troubled by them, brother. Oh? And why not? You were given an impossible problem. Do not blame yourself for failing to solve it. I'm sure the dwarves would feel differently. This doesn't fix things. No. But it is a start. A reminder, brother. Sparklefine slag we collected could be of considerable use in the hands of Brock or Sindri. The air smells a lot cleaner. That's because we shut down the rigs. Back to Thor and Odin stories? Where were we? You can't forget Amir, the first giant. Odin carved him up to form the realms from his body and let the torrent of his blood nearly drown every giant alive. What about the giants of Jotunheim? They all seemed dead when we finally made it there. That remains a mystery. Though admittedly, it sounds like the Aesir God's dream. What about Fjorgen? Thor's mother was a giant, wasn't she? Indeed she was. The circumstances of her demise were murky at best, but not sure I can blame Odin for that one. He wasn't the same after. Oh, I know. There was Skavi, Queen of the Hunt. Aye, she spurned Odin's affections, so he tricked her into killing her father. There was Starkather the Mighty, the Jotnar military leader. Slandered by Odin, tricked and murdered by Thor. And there was Thrym the Cunning, the giant king who stole Thor's hammer. Odin traded him Freya to get it back, then sent Thor in disguise to murder his entire court. Who else? Ah, Grungnir the Brawler. 
The stone giant. Aye. Mocked by Odin, murdered by Thor. Enough of this. But there's more. I do not care. War with Odin is not the answer. The key to that watchtower door should be on this island somewhere. The ground looks weak down here, Father. That gear looks like it would freeze. Maybe that lift can help us get higher. Might be easier to break that ground from up there. We're looking for. Now we must head to that watchtower on the shore. What are you not saying? I just need you to trust me.
So not all dwarves can do that thing Brock and Sindri do, right? Do they just walk between realms and turn up somewhere else? Indeed, that's a rare skill. I gather one carefully cultivated by some secretive dwarven guild or other. Probably for the best. Them alone doing it is disconcerting enough. Thanks for grabbing that for us. Can you hear that? No. Thought I heard a voice. Let's keep going, lad. Just put the key into that lock, brother. There. If you could give that drum a good loud strike. Hmm. What? So that's the voice I heard. I'd hoped it would have escaped by now, but... We'll need to free it from its restraints. Bokka. I captured it many years ago. Broden. Yes. I thought it an imaginative and eye-catching way to earn his favor. It worked? That it did. <laughs> this creature, you enslaved it. Aye. But why? Because I was young and stupid. And I didn't know what it was like to be chained in one place for years at a time, with nothing to occupy your mind but pain. If you could... Uh.
creature's hurting. But we're going to free it. But it will always be chained. You know that as well as I. Now for the other thing. There may be a way to reach it behind that collapsed debris. <laughs> Angry with me, aren't you, brother? I remember the feeling of a yoke around my neck. I would not wish it upon another. <laughs> Anything illuminating? Inspiring lyricism from the mind of Kvasia. That was a good source of oil for Odin's lanterns. Oil for lanterns? Whatever anger you're feeling, whatever loathing toward me, it's nothing to what I've said to myself. some sort of device. There's a dock down there. 
but it looks like it's blocked. Hmm? that dock can lead us to the tail. Let's get back to the boat. You never spoke of this creature. Does that surprise you? That an old man would be ashamed of the mistakes he's made. No. I thought, I'd hoped the creature would be long expired by now. But apparently the Aesir couldn't even be bothered to mercy kill it once it was no longer useful. We could kill it. No, not when we can save it. Good, we can reach the tail from this dock. Still save this broken creature. I know what it is to be imprisoned like this. I can't just leave it. And if it is beyond saving? I don't understand. Let us continue. <clears throat> that rope should take us where we need to go.
Encouragement. Can you get me closer to its eyes? Uh, or a face to face, uh, Bubba. Yeah, I don't think we can do anything with that yet. Creature, the mining rigs. Their mistakes, Vimir. But it's Odin's fault. That's not an excuse, little one. Well, thank you for saying it. You great blubbering beast. Shoo! It's not moving. Why is it not moving? It has grown accustomed to its chains. But no. No, we can fix this. We just need to chase it off and scare it. Something. There is no making things right. Only better than they were. the wind blowing on its face. I can feel it. May you provide some comfort. That's not enough. It seldom is. I think it means seeing more raiders come back as Hellwalkers lately. I thought freeing the Valkyrie Queen was supposed to restore balance to the realms and keep that from happening. That's a good question, lad, and a troubling one. If Hell's filled up again, it suggests that something's been hindering Sigrun's efforts, or perhaps something even more urgent is keeping her distracted and unable to visit, even occasionally. Yeah, sorry, Mimir.
you ever think of cooking meat with those blades of yours? No. They would foul the meat. Oh, because of the magic on them? The blood. Ah, yes. Carry on then. What's the deal with Odin's ravens? They can just transport him anywhere? Except for the realm between realms, thankfully. Why? Harder to find, thanks to dwarven enchantments and Yggdrasil's very own nature. Hmm. Lucky us. Hello? Huh. Seems abandoned.
think we need more special equipment to use this. Nothing, brother. Just... You ever have those moments where you wish you could... go back? Rewrite your own past. Make different decisions. Journeying through time is more trouble than it is worth. Ah, fair point. You're speaking metaphorically, right? No. Of course you're not. Father, look, we can chisel through this door. Oh, glad to see that still works. Nice, nice. A while ago, you mentioned Odin's ravens. What's to stop him from using them to pop into existence and kidnap anybody he wants? Consent. The only way to travel by Odin's ravens is by your own choice. Oh, it's not so bad then. Going to Derlin's? Hope he'll be happy we fixed those rakes. This is the safety office? Well, the sign of hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. For Darlin? Do you have an appointment? Uh, no. Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> here to collect on something, pal. I think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is going to scare me into somehow approving Estrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <gasps> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get... You chop her head off with that too, eh? 
She was my wife. Dina and I wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, come, come. Failed. Faye is dead. Rest of them are. One's left alive after pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin and free Svartalfine from the Aesir. Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Wait, before you go. Take this. What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the All Father's given name and, uh, yeah, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Pay it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. Hey there. So what about get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Diener? Oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. Hey, this isn't a fine. Not now. There are enemies ahead. Oh, 
Okay, as I was saying, I think Derlin wrote down directions. The dwarf has given us a map. Sort of. Uh, you smell him, but it seems to lead to a mine beyond that mountain. Ah. Tyr! Derlin helped us anyway. Not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight. This thing looks like it can take us up the mountain. Maybe we'll be able to see a mine up there. Ah, nothing quite like a dwarven train ride. We can take that train up the mountain when you're ready, brother. Hearing. No one said it until you did, just now. Darlin! He didn't need to say it, brother. It was written all over his face. Uh, well, burned, I should say. Into his head. He burned that into Darlin's head? Failed rebellions tend to warrant swift and enduring retribution. He is a captain of Odin. Aye, and the bearer of Galahorn. True believer, that one. There are few things so dangerous in a man as lack of doubt. like we're here. Come on. This way. I can see another train. Let's look for a way to get over there. You know, maybe finding Tyr is our best protection. Seemed like Odin really didn't want us to find it. Once Tyr's free and can be God of War again, Odin won't have time to worry about us. If that is his war to fight, he may have it. Deactivated, but yes. Likely one belonging to Bari, the dwarf, builder of the Great Hall, Lua.
may need some special equipment to use this. We may need some special equipment to use this. Is that a Trekkie? What happened here? Use caution. I think it's dead. Yep, definitely dead. Hey, I wonder if... Atreus! Drekius will kill the first one we found.
If so, it was their aggression that got them both killed. Down there, I can see a mine. That has to be what Derlin was talking about. Tracks up on the left there. Might be another train we can take. Father, what if a war with Odin isn't just tears to fight? What if it's ours too? War is not the only way. We're gods. Better gods. We're trying to stop Ragnarok, to help people. And what if the only way to do that is war? Atreus. Forge ahead. Unintended, I imagine. Looks like we have to get this one back on the track. Thing is small. Okay, we need to go left. Wait, I meant my life. Keep going. We're so close, just a little to the left. That's way too far. Mimir, tell him left. We're so close, just a little to the left. Yeah, that's it. 
Round two. Here we go. Whenever you're ready. Yeah, covered in algae. I was thinking we could show it to Brock and Sindri when we got back. Here. Okay, so, we came here looking for Tyr because we don't trust Odin, right? If you think about it, war could... Uh-oh. Said it, little brother. The Alpha. Oh! 
I see a passage if we can get through this ore. The whetstone of the night, Ripper. When resisting an occupation, sometimes the most obvious methods are the best. You know. No longer of you. But enough about you. I'm talking about the whetstone. mouth you had on the train, lad. It's just a word. I've heard way worse from... The word does not matter. You lost control. We were falling through the air. I thought we were gonna die. Is that what you truly wish your last word to be? No. In moments of crisis, panic does nothing. Harness it. Let it serve you. Lead into the mine. We'll need to get past this cargo. Looks like the water powers the crane that's keeping the cargo up. Hey, looks like you stopped the water flow on that trough. That's it! Let's head across. There's 
There's a bracer to the left of the chest. Maybe you can light it? Good bet there's a couple more near here. Let's find them, yeah? Never do seem to get rid of those things. Is cooperative in large scare quotes. Be able to get up there if you help me. <laughs> Great. I'll head across for a better look. <sighs> Father. There's a gate up here heading towards the entrance to the mine. If you can get up here, I'll need your help lifting it. If. Oh, come on. You can jump that. Your knees aren't that bad. Atreus. Might you be able to freeze it? Close. Try again. I hope you can make that jump. It's another one of those wooden troughs. I wonder how the dwarfs thought of stuff like this. Hi. Might be the great motivator of convenience. Why do the work when you can get the wet stuff to do it for you? Sure hope Tears here. Atreus, we seek information. I know. Stop acting like I'm trying to start a war. Yet you do not say otherwise. Others? Maybe we can lay this to rest a bit, eh?
lift on your side. I will lift on mine. <laughs> Heavier than I thought. <clears throat> Thanks. Let's keep moving. <clears throat> Found Darlin's mine entrance. Got something else for you. Sindri! What is it? Since you're currently lacking a light source, sorry, and have no way of seeing exactly what untold horrors lurk in the dark, these will help. Okay, back to your exploring now. Off with you. Thanks, Sindri. Hey, wait, what do you mean by untold? Horrors. Crane's moving this way. Stay there. Yes, sir. Darlin might have been as well-oiled as this crane. I don't believe he'd lead us astray. You think the lad's too trusting? He is eager to prove himself. It clouds his judgment. Oh, I know you have more faith in him than that, brother. of Kapa 
us here. Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of his audience. Anything? We keep moving. I think this is it. This is the mine. Look out! The Alpha! Well, looks like the official entrance to the mine is blocked. But there's gotta be another way. This way. Nice. Not a dead end. Come on, let's see where this goes. Uh, these guys again? Where are they all coming from? It certainly smells like we're headed into a mine. I think I can hear the water, too. Slow down, Atreus. Take care. Be ready. So, I think I found where those wretches were coming from. They will overwhelm you quickly. Stay close! <laughs> <laughs> Keep moving. I'm sorry. I know you said not to. But I can't stop thinking about this. We spend all of our time fighting bad stuff. And I don't get why we can't do that alongside Tyr. We do not know him. We saw his shrines. He's a leader. He stood up to Odin when no one else would. If he's done it before, why wouldn't he do it again? Images from long ago do not tell a whole story. There's a door. Once we get off this, let's check there for Tyr. It's gotta be close. I can't help but feel like you're angry with me or something. Ever since we got to Sparto Farm, you've been critical of my every move. If you don't think I can lead us, just say so. It is not your competence that is in question. Okay, but what does that mean? Consider your intent. Oh. The 
This place is huge. Must have taken ages to build. Another door. We'll have to check that one too. Bird's instructions do not say which one. Nope. We're on our own here. Your question from before, about my intent. I intend to help the God of War stop Odin. And that means freeing him from whatever prison he's in right now. Brace yourselves, friends. Sindri? Oh. And be careful exiting that thing. One foot at a time, there are loose, rusty nails everywhere. Have you seen any signs of tear? As if I would navigate this maze of running sewage. No, I'm sure you'll manage that on your own. I don't know. The water looks pretty clear here. Keyword, looks. I'm here for you. Fire's actually a disinfectant, so these are very hygienic. Strike true. I'll heat up the forge. It fits. Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Gonna keep it spatter-free this time, right? Kratos? Want something in particular? I'll take him. Now, just because you've got new armor doesn't mean you should let yourself get knocked around more. Very well. Look, there's a door just across this gap. Tear could be right there. Go for it. Whoever wrote this certainly had an eye for detail. The water flow's blocked. Sounds like you got the water moving along, brother. What next? That worked. Let's get to the door. Come on. Here? Well, I certainly don't think this is where Tyr currently is. He, he's got to be here somewhere. This mine is huge. Atreus, what do you intend to stop Odin from doing? You speak as if you know his plan. I don't know his plan. That's why we're... Ahem. Brother, with Fimble Winter underway and Ragnarok around the corner, Odin will be desperate. Whatever he's planning to do surely won't be to the benefit of anyone but himself. Exactly. Across the way, there's another door. Maybe that's the one. Learn anything? Huh. 
Glad we explored. Not to be discouraging, but it is a mine after all. Namir, that is discouraging. Uh, did you see that over there? There's a broken door up to the left behind this crane. Maybe Tyr tried to escape. We should look. Almost there. Shall we? Indeed, and then stolen by Ulfjolf, the thief.
landing. That overflowing water is powering the drain. Clever. Mm. We'll be up there in no time. Keep the water flowing over the side. that lift up. You can't be far. Okay, new exercise. Let's think about how Tyr's probably feeling locked up in this mine. If I were imprisoned by Odin and finally freed, Odin would obviously be at the top of my list. But I would just want to fight something. Anything. Even if it was just to know I still could. here. Look around. This dwarf didn't make it out. Is that a relic? be able to get out of here this way. Another empty vault. Ahem. Little brother, perhaps it's time no, we... don't even say it. 
We're gonna find him. Look, another door on the other side of the cavern. Let's go. believe we're above where we got off the boat by Sindri. This mine is one enormous <laughs> spiral. <laughs> I think I can hear something in there. statue. Not just any statue. That stony visage hung over the entrance to the world myth. Built by Durin the Generous. I believe that's all of the rebel artifacts. We can return to Brock whenever you're ready. <laughs> Another drop of old brother. <laughs> 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 you're on fire, Kratos. They will fire. <laughs> Largely abandoned. It is unlikely. Here's here. I know. Oh, wait. Derlin's direction stopped at the entrance to the mine. We just have to keep searching until we find him. You said you'd follow my lead, and I say we keep looking. So knock it off. Watch yourself. I will follow, but I stick to what I see. You did not agree with me, but you. Will not speak to me this way. Are we clear? Sir. <laughs> what happened? Why didn't that work? The chain is blocked. Yo. Should be clear now. Ready when you are. One more door. That one has to be it. We will see. Seems like we'll have to get to it first. Climb across. Look for another way. I think I see a crank over here. Atreus. Another mental exercise. Would one who spends their life fighting, such as Tyr, have any desire to prove themselves? The proof leaves a wake of destruction. But if the wake of destruction is a bunch of bad guys, why does that matter? 
You're strong, and you did the right thing. War does not measure the strength of a man. I hope one day you understand. Okay, it looks like this machine is dropping ore into the water trough. We still have to go back and check out that last door, right? to be still. <clears throat> this looks familiar. We're back in the spiral section of the mine. Do you hear that, brothers? I don't think we're alone. Ears open. Eyes up. It came from over here. There's a passage leading out. Atreus, do my words irritate you? It's fine. I get it. Brothers! Wait! Is that light up ahead there? Hey, this might be it. That door's barred. They must be trying to keep something in. You don't lock a door like that to secure the spare bedclothes. I see what we must do. Careful. Behind you! <laughs> 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 
Clearly they don't want us in there. This has to be it. Back to it then. Trickery is this Odin. What game do you play with me now? We're not with Odin. We're the good guys. Those blades. I know you. God killer. Have you come for me now? Only to free you. Stay away. Rather let me try. Tear. Tear. Look. You know me, don't you? You... You killed Mimir! No! No, 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 no! Yeah, we, we brought him right back! Yeah, stay away from me, you monsters! Stop! We need him! Why? Find your son. Uh, 
Me alone. Tear, listen, I swear we're not here to hurt you. We're just trying to get, get you away out. From me, please. Take you somewhere safe I away from you. Odin. Show mercy. This is my father. We help people. I don't belong out here, please. It's worse when he's angry. Father! Are you not a soldier? Are you not a leader of men? Master yourself! My son brought us to this place. For you! Look at him! You? Why? You don't know me. I know what you stood for. You helped the giants. We're returning the favor. We? We are leaving. Are you coming with us? you in the lake. You had a spear. I thought you needed a weapon. Walking stick? No. A kind thought, but no. Thank you, no. But... Okay. I, uh... I, I ran because I don't always know what's real. Sometimes there's a... There's no shame in that, brother. We live in strange times. Everyone hears him talk. We must return home. Can you feel that? A wind blowing from over here. Maybe there's an exit nearby. Are there names by which I should call you? I'm Atreus. You already know Mimir. And that's my father, Kratos. How does the son of a Spartan come to speak for the Jotnar? My mother was the last giant in Midgard. Laufey? Laufey. I remember that name. She tried to help people, too. She's in the light of Alfheim now. You have my sympathies. Oh. Are you okay? These are just much stronger when you're not sitting down. Please, let me get that. It's the least I can do. Whoa. Why risk Odin's wrath to free me? Well, Ragnarok is coming. I hope you knew that. We thought you'd want to help. You freed me only to start a war? No! Um... Um... Sotia, it's good to see you in the flesh again. Mimir, what's become of you? Following in your footsteps. Betrayal, indefinite imprisonment, execrable torture at the hands of the old father. You didn't deserve such treatment. Did you? I will say my view was a touch better than yours. We found him at the top of a mountain with tree roots wrapped all around him. The only way to free him was to... Oh, that. Highly pleasant for all parties involved. Ah. You okay? The light. It's... It's been so long. There's an outcropping just ahead. The shade will make it easier on your eyes. Come on. You said Ragnarok is coming. Which means Balder... Balder is dead. Odin sent him to track down a giant in Midgard. And then he found Kratos at... 
Anyway, I'd promised to take these two to the tallest peak in the realms if they'd chop off my head and convince Freya to bring it back. Amir, speak of Balder. I was getting to that. It wasn't all kill this, kill that. Hey, we're back in the wetlands. Watch out! No, 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 no. no. It's okay, I've got you. attack. You should have taken the spear. Defended yourself. No. I've abjured all violence. But you're the god of war. I left that behind long ago. Odin starts Ragnarok. You really wouldn't fight? Not even if I wished to. Before we go any further, the truth. What is it you want from me? You, you speak of Ragnarok. Is it a god of war you came to find? Is that the tear you need? Atreus. I... Forgive me, that I am grateful for my freedom. But if you want me to follow you to war, or worse yet, lead you to it, then kill me now. My fight is gone. Damage is done. No one's killing you, brother. Better that than to live to see Ragnarok. We do not seek war. We just want some answers. I don't know how to help you. It doesn't matter. The Giants trusted you. That's the tear we need. We need you. A good night's rest and maybe some food. I think you killed the guards bringing me dinner. Brother, perhaps now you'd like to finish the story? Uh, the sons of Thor attacked us. We killed them. Balder tried to kill Freya. I killed him. But you skipped over how he fought and freed the Valkyries. And that the giants are all gone. And now they called me Loki. And finding the shrines. The giants and... are gone. When we got to Jotunheim, they were all dead. Dead. Do you think Odin? We do not know. I think we're getting out of here not a moment too soon. Whoa, what are those? Reinforcements from Asgard. The Ainhuriar will want to investigate my disappearance thoroughly. Are they using the sky to travel between realms? Odin's got tricks up his sleeve we haven't dared to consider. They're coming down on either Valir too. Will the dwarves be okay? The time for such concerns has passed. We must leave. Now. Oh, <laughs> 
Yggdrasil. It's been too long. I had forgotten. Beauty. Tyr, in your travels, did you ever hear the giants talk about Loki? I'm sorry. That name doesn't sound familiar. The giants are... were... very private people. Makes sense. Perhaps after a rest. Treehouse. Lord Tyr, you're really alive! Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, uh, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. Well, I'll be! So, can we talk about what to do next? There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. Hold still. Hold still. Yep. <clears throat> oh, much better. Thank you. See? Sleep tight, Tyr. I'm gonna turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tyr. Sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey! Come see what I got for you! I'm sure we won't be interrupting any goings on. And I'll arrange accommodations. So that's what's left to tear, huh? Back where I come from, we'd say he's been through a few things. Hmm. So have we all. Well, ain't you philosophical? That's all I need. To be honest, that's all I can. Some food then. Oh, nothing much. Perhaps some hard tack. Hard tack. Any sort of humble ships. I'll see what I can find. Yeah, I'll take your crap. Hand it over already. Yeah, yeah, I'll take it. Need something special? You know what? It must be in the pantry. I'll just look quietly. Put some herd on them. <laughs> Would have been a shame to have left that behind. What are you thinking, brother? I am thinking... I 
want things to be the way they were. Well, I'd like to claim a tree again. Certain ships have sailed. I just wish Atreus were not so restless. I care only for your safety. I know, brother. But holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. His game is fresh. Expect too much. Ah, perhaps. Pity Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. No, I don't suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh! You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I have to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just. Wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting an old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. Oh, look, I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by not getting yourself murdered. <gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it, though? How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So, you know where Freya is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first, and then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? <laughs> 